I'm equipped with enough manpower to fight along in Iraq. Not because of them big guns and artillery I got on my back, but my faith got me feeling like that. Ever since I was birthed from the dirt of Mississippi, I believe in this thing. Manifest hard in God, walk by faith and not by sight and believe the unseen. And keep non-believers the far end of your receiving because people are liable to hinder your dream. At times it seems that my doctrine degree in faith cannot be composed at any college. I seek for faith and wisdom on a daily basis, so this is my quest for knowledge. So let me game you a little bit. Walk with me, talk with me. Let me show you how my faith grows to be like this. See, I went from chilling with people who rob stores to chilling with people who own stores. Because I always prayed to the Lord to be around positive folks who want it more. Negative folks are classified as showboats and I do not want to ride unless you possess some of that strong faith inside. That's the only way that I'm rolling. And a pistol full of faith is the only gun that I'm toting. In that case, I love to do drive-bys. I'll shoot up everybody's house that had a spouse who let their faith die. See, this faith that I accumulate will cause Cardinal to rent to choose another due date. So be a collector, be gone, because me and my faith has grown to be friends. Indeed, faith, I promise you a friend in need, and I need a lot of you, and it's true. In order to have a faith so deep, you must understand there's one God, one creator, one chain of events that led to the Garden of Eden. You must manifest hard in God and engage in deep reading, and I'll give it away. I call it the abortion of my faith. Anything is liable to happen in your life. All depends on the portion of your faith. And if you're wise enough to ask God questions, you must be mature enough to listen. People ask me my day-to-day -day profession. I say I talk to God for a living. And I'm on a mission to get my family out the kitchen. In order to make it to the promised land, I can't worry about the next man's decision. See, worry about the next man's material wealth is a common factor. Believing I can have the same thing that he has should be the status quo. It's clear to see that some folks don't know that I'm the lyrical host, so it'll be vital if y'all jotted these notes. See, here I go. I'm going to miss that steadily counting. And my faith's so straight, I'll be ready to move a mountain. I'll be like, what it be like? I'll pour dirt from the earth, put in your eye in order for you to see right. Not saying I'm Jesus, but I'll be with him a lot. It's number elevated meditation conversation when he chills at my spot, and he chills at y'all's spot too. But some of y'all don't open the ear when he's speaking to you. See, faith got me speaking. Speaking the truth and my prayers bound to reach heaven without raising the roof and reaching these young folks is what gets me through. I don't move unless God tell me to move. I don't even travel unless he give me the route. Psychologists talk to the willing within my faith, bring healing so the need and saying doubt. And I might as well say, ouch, God and sprung somebody nerve. I never fight the devil long. I beat him instant with the power of words. In order to have a faith like mine, you must be willing to listen to a person like me. Instantly, you'll see your faith increase within a week. And that's a money back guarantee. You know why? Because my faith's so deep.